Welcome back to another video. So they got the perps out here sending a subliminal message. This guy right here. All right. Um, signing the slip for my for my daughter. He comes, uh, you know, takes off his glasses. And then one of the teachers sitting down, they get extending her arms out with her palm out, you know, like that whole begging thing that they do. Talk about the subliminal. Now, again, go to my YouTube channel, Nigel Nicholson. You'll see I wear my glasses, okay? I'm not gonna be walking on the street with reading glasses to ruin my eyes. And that's what they do, right? Again, understand how they try to create an adversarial mindset within you. And again, this is not, they're doing this, okay? They're the one that's doing this. You understand psychology, you understand coercive programming, you'll understand. They're the ones that's doing this. Because if they're not doing this, you wouldn't act in a certain way. You wouldn't behave in a certain way. You wouldn't think in a certain way in the way that they want you to think and, and, and behave the way they want you to behave, All right? So I've never shy away from, uh, you know, when they try to make you feel suspicious or any shit like that, all right? So again, but remember, it's how they try to make you feel and what they want you, what they want your mind to believe, right? All, why? For control. For control, to silence you, you know, to stop you from seeking the truth or uh, seeking truth or even speaking truth because their lies is their greatest weapon they use against us and the truth is our greatest weapon to use against them right so like i said my youtube channel my facebook ch my facebook page right so i'll be a damn fool walking the street with reading glasses that i don't need ruining my eyes and I want you to understand the idioticness of it all, right? <laughs> do again. So this is how they make you do things to cause harm to yourself as well as harm to others, right? So I don't need my glasses to, to see when I'm walking. I need it for reading. Sometimes when I go to the school to fill out a form, I walk with my glasses. You know, today I didn't know that they had a form to fill out, that she had a trip because she was in the school yesterday. Again, she was sick. And that's it. And they know this. They know this. They know this. And it doesn't mean that because you notice that it, it doesn't affect you. Because it certainly does. Again, and they know this. They know it affects you. <laughs> they know that there is no defense, no defense against what it is that they're doing unless you have first-hand knowledge of what is going on and what they're, what they're about to do. Okay, they know this, and they know I know this. So, and also when they use, you're using silent sound. There's nothing you can do to stop them. There's nothing you can do to manipulate your emotions. There's nothing you can do. All right. That's why I say that when you start, when they're using silent sound on you, and you're gonna go through whatever emotions they want you to go through, you just go through it, but understand what is being done so you won't over you won't become overly emotional right so you know you got to understand that right so you don't become overly emotional okay now look at this little kid here over here in the purple sweater i mean the purple shirt this kid has been in this store from the time me and my dog went to the store mind you we went into the store to get to get her sandwich I went to school, went to take her to school, then I had to go to the bank, walk back out to the bank, which is down that way, okay? And uh, to get money out, then walk back to the school, right? And he is now just coming out of that store. It has been over, I would say probably about a half an hour, right? Maybe a little less, you know, but I, I realized that when I walked into the store, he came from behind the one, there's like a um, part that leads to the back of the counters and he came over, stand by me. You know, like I said, they're, they're always using kids again, cause you know, that's what cults do. Destructive cults, all right? They're very good at brainwashing and indoctrinating children as well as young people. You know, Christianity, Christian religious people, and those who are 
the leaders in the, of religious organizations, they're very good at manipulating people. And they know this. You know, very good at that. So, <laughs> yeah. So anyhow, like I said, this is, this is what they do in order to cause you to harm yourself and whatever by creating an adversarial mindset within your mind. And again, it's not your fault as a TI, and I don't blame you, right? Because this is what these type of psychological conditioning programming do. And if we were to do it to them, they will have the same type of adversarial mindset, okay? And they do have an adversarial mindset, right? But it's not because they were brainwashed like you and I was. They were brainwashed using a different method, right? Same tactics, same, uh, I shouldn't say a different method, but different ideology, right? Same tactic, same method, just a different ideology and what they put into them. The idea that they're, they're doing good, the idea that they're God's soldiers or whatever. And particularly, like I said, when you look at uh, these programs and every couple of, every decade they repeat them in terms of the influence that which people of authority have over people and the indoctrination process and how those people that are indoctrinated by the religious sect and those within law enforcement how they will commit crimes because those of the authority whether they feel that the their pastors or the or the religious leaders are are the prophet of God or those within the law enforcement uh, of the authority of the badge uh, of their shield they will commit some of the gross grossest crime and grossest evil you've ever seen and like I said <laughs> I know this stuff this is why now it's so difficult for them to manipulate me in such a way that they want to doesn't mean that they can't manipulate me doesn't mean that I'm not affected it just means that I can see a lot of tactics and avert the, the traps, right? Now, you're not going to avert every trap, but for the most part, if you, if you avert most of it, you're pretty good at my book. All right? So, yeah. So look at her grabbing her dog there. Tell you, the pumps all over the place. They never stop, and I'll never stop. <laughs>